Were you expecting someone else? I may not be Gregory Peck, but people have said that I do look like him. I am John Phillips, the United States Ambassador to Italy, and I'm sorry that I cannot personally be with you this evening to enjoy a Roman holiday, but I do have a very good excuse. While you will be watching the movie, I will be at the White House having dinner with President Obama and Prime Minister Renzi along with a few others. I did want to let you know that this movie is one of my all-time favorites. Directed by William Wyler, it stars the incomparable Audrey Hepburn and Gregory Peck. And tonight, you will have the pleasure of viewing it in the spectacular Piazza di Spagna, where one of its most iconic scenes was filmed. Roman Holiday remains as fresh today as it was in 1953. The film was a great success when it was released, and its witty dialogue, romantic plot, and superb acting have vaulted it into the ranks of classic American cinema. The other big star of the movie is, of course, the city of Rome, with all of its sparkle and beauty. Tonight's screening is in honor of the 100th anniversary of Gregory Peck's birth. Some years ago, I had the great pleasure of meeting Gregory Peck, one of the most popular American stars of Hollywood's golden age, a man of great charisma and talent, and he was also a man of great integrity and a committed humanitarian. Among the many honors bestowed on him was an Oscar for his portrayal of Atticus Finch in the 1962 masterpiece, To Kill a Mockingbird. He was also awarded the highest civilian honor the United States bestows on its citizens, the Presidential Medal of Freedom. Peck once said that former President Lyndon Johnson told him that if Johnson had run for re-election and won, he would have offered Peck the post of U.S. Ambassador to Ireland. Although I would have liked to see Gregory Peck become an ambassador, I think it would have been even more fitting to have had him here in my current job as the U.S. Ambassador in Rome. After all, as a star of Roman Holiday, he has for over 60 years been a true ambassador between the United States and the Eternal City. And so, buon divertimento a tutti.